This is an intro. Don't need to intro. I don't need intro. This is just a fake show. It's just a fake show. Fake show. Fake show. This is an intro. Don't need to intro. I don't need intro. This is just a fake show. It's just a fake show. Fake show. Fake show. YouTube, what is up? I'm your homeboy, homeboy Josh, back at you with a review of Nectar. Nectar is a new juice line that was sent on over free for the purpose of this review by thecloudyvapor.com. Remember to use code OBJOSH10 at checkout for 10% off. Thecloudyvapor.com sent on over their sour line, and he also sent on over a new juice by them called Melt. We're going to start out with the strawberry flavor from Nectar. And uh, the bottles are all pretty generic. They got this sort of broken glass kind of look to them, this sort of uh, abstract sort of thing going on. Mm. On the nose, it's very thick, very rich, uh, natural strawberry smell to it. Mmm. I was expecting it to be more sour, honestly. I mean, it definitely has like a tart kind of flavor to it, but damn. What it is, is just a very natural, seeded strawberry. I mean, I get the seeds, I get the strawberry, and the flavor kind of evolves a little bit there. Um, it kind of changes uh, a little bit for the aftertaste. It's nice. It's really nice. It's a really good strawberry vape, and I'm not big strawberry vapor. I'm not at all big strawberry vapor. Mmm. It's almost like a strawberry hookah. It's really good. Very mouth-watering strawberry. Like, I'm drooling a little bit right now. That's really nice. Really nice, and I'm not a strawberry vapor at all. It's almost a, a succulent sort of flavor on the aftertaste. It's really nice. Next up, we're going to take a look at the apple flavor from Nectar. Mmm, definitely a green apple. Oh, no, it's a... I thought it was going to be like a green apple, but that might be a red delicious. That's nice. Mm. Again, mouth-watering flavor. Excellent. If you like apple vapes, like a natural apple vapes. This is a very natural line from what I can tell. Extremely natural. That's fantastic. That's good. Tart, sweet, um, almost starchy on the apple at times. It's really nice. These are really close to hookah flavorings, if you ask me. I was really into hookah back in the day. Um, when I was in college, high school even, I was really into hookah. And that's hookah flavorings right there. That's what it's most similar to. Last up on the sour line, we're going to take a look at the watermelon. Not usually big on watermelon in a vape. But that might change my mind. Wow. I mean, these smell really natural, like unmistakably natural. Like if I smelled that blindfolded, didn't know what it was, I would think watermelon. Same thing with the apple, same thing with the strawberry. I mean, these are super natural, perhaps the most natural flavorings I've ever encountered. I don't say that lightly. I mean, these are perhaps the most natural flavorings in e-juice that I have ever ever encountered. These are pure strawberry, pure apple. Let's see about the watermelon. Yeah, yeah. Watermelon doesn't do it for me. Watermelon for me always comes out a little bit salty. And that's what I get here. I get like salty at the end. Watermelon is really hard to get right. It always comes out salted. No, no. Doesn't taste like watermelon at all. No. No, not even an artificial watermelon. I would never guess that that was watermelon if you put it in front of me at all. So that's the disappointment of the bunch, I think. The watermelon flavor just isn't there. But the apple and the strawberry, those are excellent. The watermelon smells like watermelon, though. I mean, they got that perfect. I mean, it smells like fresh-cut watermelon. But, I mean, this isn't juice that you smell. It's juice that you vape. So, it, it, no, it doesn't do it. It's salty. Watermelon always comes out salty. I've never found a good watermelon vape. It's one of those flavors that no one can seem to get right. 
Last up by the same people that brought you nectar is Melt. Melt is very, very tasty white chocolate strawberry. White chocolate strawberry, I don't like white chocolate. And as I've said before, I'm not a big strawberry vapor. So mm, let's see. Whoa. On the nose, it's white chocolate and strawberry. Absolutely. Almost like a something else there too. I get behind it. Almost like a oh it's almost like it was blended together like in a shake. Let's put it that way. Whoa. That's really nice. It's really nice. It almost takes on like a bakery quality to it. That white chocolate, how it mingles with the strawberry. It's almost like a bakery quality. It's really good. It's creamy. It's decadent. Yeah, it's um, very, very creamy, almost custardy. It's not what I was expecting at all. And those flavors are never something that I would seek out in the real world as something that I would want to partake in. But in a vape, for some reason, it kind of works. That's delicious. That could be an all-day vape for me. That's my favorite of the bunch, I gotta say. This melt, it's fantastic. Um, the other ones are good too, except for the watermelon, but no one does watermelon right, so I really won't hold that against them too much because no one does watermelon well. Um, the apple is a fantastic, very natural apple. The strawberry is a wonderful, natural strawberry. I mean, I get the seeds of the strawberry. I get everything about that strawberry. It is perfect. Um, one of the best, two of the best natural fruit flavors I've ever ever had in a vape. I don't say that lightly. They're excellent. And the melt is just a complete surprise. I was not expecting to like that at all, but uh, it's fantastic. It's excellent. What's most interesting about these juices, though, is that they use tobacco-free nicotine. The tobacco-free nicotine comes from Next Generation Labs. Um, this communication comes to me from thecloudyvapor.com that wanted to send me some more information about tobacco-free nicotine. Tobacco-free nicotine, TFN, took four years and five million dollars to develop. Over the four-year period, we did extensive research and collaborated with the Pharmaceutical Sciences and Organic Chemistry Department at the University of California, Irvine. This is a very complicated synthetic process made with custom specialty chemicals. We have several processes and application patents. The end result is we recreated the nicotine molecule. We have a 99.98% purity level and we are devoid of the residuals that are contained in tobacco nicotine. The biological impact is the same as tobacco nicotine without the harsh taste and smell. The result is a smoother, more flavorful vaping experience. When vaping liquids with tobacco nicotine versus TFN, consumers choose TFN. We want to give consumers the choice to be truly 100% tobacco free, and TFN allows them that choice. Pretty darn interesting. Tobacco free nicotine. I gotta say, they are extremely, extremely smooth juices. Very little throat hit on any of them. They go down very easy. Uh, they were sent on over free for the purpose of this review by thecloudyvapor.com, and you can pick them up there, 22 bucks for a 30 milliliter bottle. Excellent line. Till next time, I'm your homeboy, old boy Josh. Vape on, vapors.